Hello everyone, um, back here and back with the giraffe idea because I didn't finish it. I think I didn't say what I wanted to say, but if you, if, if this is the first video you're watching, we were talking about me and my client hunting a giraffe and there was a lot of questions, even from hunters, why would you hunt a giraffe? And I try to explain that hunting is not about ego. It's not about hunt just what's challenge for you and what's fun. You need to hunt what's necessary to hunt for conservation. And you can't put one species over another just because that one is cute and that one's not. This is conservation. You need to keep a balance in a, in a nature. But I would like to go closer to trophy hunting because these hunts, they would have to be done anyway. If there is no trophy hunter anyway, when there is a number of the cool hunt needs to be done, it will be done. But when there is a like, trophy hunter who needs a trophy, who wants the trophy, we are always happy. Everyone's happy about it because it's extra money. And these extra money, they're not used by the owners of the private game reserves to go to vacations or something like that. No, they don't have the money for this, I can assure you. But these money are used for the conservation. Let's stay with the same species. Let's say we hunted giraffe with the trophy hunter. It was old bull. He passed his genes, so there was not much reasons to keep him there. But the money we, we gain by this trophy hunt, we used for other purposes. Here is a video you can see, this is like relocation. It's nothing unusual. It happens all over the South Africa. And you know, when you have a reservation, you have females, but you need some strong genetics to keep a population healthy. Then you relocate animals. It's very necessary to do for the healthy, for the healthy herds. So this is paid by money what hunters spend in your reservation. You don't get donation from all these PETA organizations and whoever beg for money. No, the private reserves taking care of themselves and mostly it's the hunters who bring this money. So thanks this money, as you can see, the team around is huge and these people don't do it for free. They have to pay their bills as well. And this is the only way how it works. So the trophy hunter brought the money and, you know, the veterinarian care or the relocation and all these things, what's necessary for healthy populations is done just thanks to hunters. So before next time and you see in a tabloid magazines or you see some organization wanna be helping animals showing like, oh, here is a bad hunter killing this beautiful animal. Just remember this video and how it's really used and that's all that's all what i wanted to say today hope you have a wonderful day and remember if you offended by hunting by weapons i have my only fans account you can go there you can only see my sexy pictures and the money you spend there will go to african conservation so bye